Yo guys, what's up? This is Tom from Unreal Meta and in this tutorial I will show you how to make a lake with Unreal Engine's new water system, so let's start. I sculpted this landscape here and made this little hole. And first of all you need two new plugins. So we go to edit, then plugins and search for water at first. So you need to check that and then search for land mass and check that too. You will need to restart the engine, just do that and we are ready to go. So close the tab and now you can search at the classes for water. And for the lake we need the water body lake and we just drag that over here. And you can see that weird animation is going on with all these bugs and we don't want that. So we go to the right under the point wave. We change the wave source from water waves asset reference to none. You can change it to Gerstner water waves if you want that, but I don't want waves for this lake. So I go to none because waves are not realistic in lakes. Just these small waves. I drag it over here and now I will adjust the scale of it. So I just leave it at this scale. And I need to sculpt some more. I just sculpt around the lake. Now it's fine because the water can only be at the normal level right now. If you have weird bugs going on like this. Or this bug, you can't see anything from underneath the water. There's this little icon right here and this ring. Just drag it up to the water surface. So it's right above or on the surface and it should be fine. Now you can dive down into the water and you can see there's some post processing going on here. And we have this underwater effect, but if we go down further, we can see it has just stopped. So we click on the icon again, and on the Z axis we just scale it up. And the water gets deeper like this. So the post processing effect is happening all underneath the water. And that's basically what we want. If you have a smaller lake, you can just leave it at one. If you have a bigger lake, you can do it three or four or higher numbers. But that's good for us. And let's say you want to adjust color. So go on your icon, then scroll down to the water material, click on that. And we have our water material here. Now you can adjust these numbers. So maybe you want a blood lake, red lake, something. Just increase the red number and it gets red. It's not that red, but you can increase it. You can do the color you want, but that's okay for me. You can tweak some settings under the post processing here, but that's very complex. And the shader that's standard here is very good. So yeah. Just like this, it's very easy to create lakes. You can enable the waves if you want. Let's say small waves here, Gerstner wave. And we can go down to waves and just decrease these numbers. You can see smaller waves are happening here. Let's say 0 0.05 and the amplitude 2. Let's say 10 here. And it's much better like this. We have this sweet bug here going on. So we can just increase the size of it again. And that should be fixed. Yeah, very easy tutorial here. I hope you liked it. If yes, leave a thumbs up. If no, leave a thumbs down. As always, I'll see you next time and bye.